Today we'll be doing some solar engraving using a magnifying glass and a homemade stencil. If you want to learn how, just keep watching. You'll need a piece of glass, like from a picture frame, and some aluminum duct tape, a cutting mat, and a craft knife. Tape up the glass to make the edges safer to touch. Draw and cut a simple design of your choice from the aluminum tape. Then carefully transfer the stencil to the center of the glass and fill in the remaining glass with more metal tape. Take your new stencil, magnifying glass, and some materials with you to a bright and sunny spot where you can easily tilt your work to directly face the sun. This technique works great on leather, cork, and cardboard, and will also engrave wood with a little extra time. You should wear dark sunglasses to make it easier to see where your concentrated light beam is going, and also consider some sunblock and a hat. Adjust the distance and angle of the magnifying glass until the point of light is as small as you can possibly make it, and slowly move the beam over all areas of the stencil. It's smart to be prepared with a spray bottle of water in case your material flares up while you're working. But to be ultra safe while using this technique, I've also got a fire extinguisher nearby. The concentrated beam of light coming from the magnifying glass gets really hot, so keep it away from living things. You can achieve slightly crisper lines if you place your stencil tape side down, which requires cutting your design backwards if it's not already symmetrical. So next time the sun comes out, try it out. I'd love to see what you create with this technique. This project is a part of my free solar class on Instructables.com, where you can learn more about harnessing the power of the sun, from backyard projects like this one to applying solar power to your microcontroller projects. I put a link in the description. It would mean so much to me if you check it out. Thanks so much for watching. Please subscribe to my channel to see more DIY projects about crafts, technology, and my life here in New York City.